Well, back here at Tri-Cities, Washington, we're all set to go with Heat 1B, a great crowd on hand, even though rain threatens here on the Columbia River. Here's the six boats that'll compete, the Kellogg's, Winston Eagle, T-Plus, American Spirit, Old Boy Alberto, and the Taco Time. As they come down this Columbia River course, on the inside, it is Kellogg's Frosted Plates with Mike Hansen, who'll try to set the pace right off of the green flag. It looks like lane number two, the Winston Eagle, is going to be the challenge boat with a Miss T-Plus on the outside of him in lane number three, and that's the way they go into the turn. Winston Eagle taking a slight advantage. Miss T-Plus going wide on the turn, way outside, cuts it in, now has fallen back to second place where he's locking up with the inside boat, the Kellogg's Frosted Flakes. No power could get to the taco time engine. Jerry Hop is on the beach. We're down to five boats. Still the leader is the Winston Eagle with Mark Tate. He's the one that won the dash for cash yesterday here on the Columbia River. He's got a good ride going for him today. He has to have a good bit of confidence going. That was a nice way to start the weekend. Still battling for second place. The inside boat is the Kellogg's Frosted Flakes. The outside boat, and you can see they're almost even, is the Miss T Plus with Stephen David. Back in the fourth position now is Albertson's American Spirits, followed by the Oh Boy Oberto, and as Jim said, Jerry Hopp and the Taco Time sitting on the beach, unable to get the engine to power up. 141.881 for the leader, Winston Eagle, Mark Tate. Showing them the short way around the course while 133.8 for this boat. Second place, Mike Hansen in the Kellogg's Frosted Flakes. Mike Hansen trying to shake the Miss T Plus on the outside. He can just see through the veil of the rooster tail. He knows he's got some competition. He has taken solo possession of second place. Mike Egret is now in fifth place in the Oh Boy Oberto as they come around the final turns. Winston Eagle, Mark Tate, has dominated this race. He didn't have much competition. The real competition was back in second place where Kellogg's Frosted Flakes now has gained himself control. And 400 points goes to Mark Tate and the Winston Eagle winning an average of 137.334. Winston Eagle finishes first, followed by Kellogg's Frosted Flakes, the Miss T Plus, American Spirit, Oh Boy Alberto, and Tom Taco time did not start. Look at the fourth place boat. Mark Evans and Albertson's American Spirit. They've got tail damage. Look at the leader, the winning boat. Mark Tate's boat had tail damage, too. Let's go down to the pits. Down here with the Happy Wisdom crew. Got a little hairy out there. You weren't really riding that water that's that steady or secure. Oh, the water's tremendously sloppy out there. It just seems like uh, every lap, it just gets worse and worse. And, uh, you know, the final heat's just going to be a real ocean. You worried at all, Steve, the way the boats are riding? Uh, well, yeah, we're concerned about how rough it is out there, but uh, when you've got the best shoe there is, he takes real good care of the equipment, pushed it just hard enough to beat him, and uh, did a tremendous job. Are you, are you trying to say this might be your day? Oh, no, I don't, I don't know. I'm, you know, you don't cock-a-doodle-doo too early, you know. 